soon I'm gonna start walking you guys through and uh, talking it out as I'm doing the latte art uh, this is late night latte art with Dylan Licka but today I am going to be using my new picture that I did a uh, product unboxing and just a first look review on now I'm gonna put it into play first time using so we'll see what happens it might take a little getting used to might not even pour anything but I'm gonna show you guys at home because I'm not afraid to make uh, make up because I'm not afraid to mess up see so I'm not even going to edit that out. I want to show you guys the real raw footage so you guys can uh, you guys can see how difficult it truly is for a home barista. And if you're having troubles at home, know that it's not just you. Even the best of us mess up. And I am not the best by any means. Get that nice swirling of the milk. So instead of a vortex, you want to get a rolling action. So you see how the milk's kind of rolling there? You don't. People get too involved in wanting to get their milk to be like a swirl. You really want to aim towards that vortex of the rolling of the milk because that rolling of the milk is going to allow for that milk foam to really mix in between all of the milk so you get a nice even pour when doing latte art. Make sure you clean that bad boy. All right. So when you get to the finished thing, you wanna make it to where it looks like, it's almost like silky paint right there. So it almost looks like it's silky paint. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and give this a little tap and a little swirl. Get that crema going around. Pour this into the pitcher. I like to pour my initial 
first pour out just because that's where all the foam stays. Alright, so from first use, I can definitely tell it's going to be a little bit more difficult. Alright, so I can already tell from first use it's going to be a little bit more difficult because with the pitcher, it's a little bit smaller than what I'm used to. Uh, the grip is also a little bit different, so I'm a lot closer to the pitcher. I'm holding the actual pitcher as opposed to the handle. Um, however, um, I believe that it will get better. It's just a little bit more difficult. So you, you actually are a lot closer to the actual espresso itself. Um, I just, it's just gonna take some getting used to, but we'll get there and I will keep practicing. Practicing makes perfect and I'm not, I'm not afraid to show you guys my failures on camera because it only makes all of us better. So thank you for watching Late Night Latte Art with Dylan Licka. I'll see you tomorrow. Roll it.